So before you get started buying a domain from HostGator, make sure you understand this, that in HostGator, you can't set an A record without having a hosting package because you must have a cPanel account in order to change an A record. Note that for our white labeling strategy, we don't need to have and pay for hosting. All we need to do is forward and mask our domains. So if you want the A record set up without having a hosting package from HostGator, you must contact their support and they can set it up for you using their registrar system. Okay, so let's go over to HostGator and see if we can find a domain name. So go to hostgator.com, come over here and click on domains. Now I've already searched for domains and found one that I want to use. So I'm just going to pop that in here. Banneradsagency.com. Click on search and it says it's available. So I'll click on add to cart. Then I can click here to view cart. And in my case, I'm not going to select the domain privacy protection. I'm going to uncheck that. That brings the price down to $12.95. Scroll down, read the terms of service, click here, click on complete order. Now at this point, you can either log in with an existing login, or if you're a new customer as I am today, I'll have to click on new customer. So fill out this form information here, your first name, last name, email, company, address, city, state, county, phone, zip, password, click on create account. So enter your credit card number, your expiration, month and year and your first name your last name and click on complete order okay so it says your order is being processed please check below to see update status of your domain and then it says thank you for your order a welcome email is being sent to you and then it has the domain name here banneradsagency.com and it was successful all right, so now let's go check our inbox. And we got an email from HostGator. Domain order provides us with our domain name here and how we can log in and manage that domain. Now we'll come back over to HostGator and just click on hide and you'll see your domain listed here. All right, so now that we have all of our white label information set up with inside of Ad Kahuna. Let's go back over to HostGator and ask them to update the A record for us. So log into your HostGator account. I'm just gonna click on support. I'm going to click on live chat. Put in my name. Are you an existing customer? Yes. Put in my primary domain. This is the domain I'm going to be using. Package type, select domain. Click on continue. Then you need to verify your HostGator login details again. Click login. What can we help you with today? Let's see what our options are. Let's say domains. I need domain assistance with. I'm going to select DNS management. Click on start chat. Click on start chat. Okay, so now I'll pop in my request here. I'm just going to say I purchased this domain from HostGator. Since I didn't purchase the hosting package, I don't have access to cPanel to update the A record. I want to forward and mask this domain. Can you please update the A record in your register system for me? I need the A record to point to this IP address and click on send. Now you may be asking, where did I get this IP address from? Well, I've got it from the Ad Kahuna white label dashboard right here it says a record should be set to this target ip address right here okay so i'm going to go back to host gator support so the only problem with this is i will not be able to validate that the ip address was put in correctly and host gator since i don't have access to cpanel so i'm totally relying on the support person to update the A record properly and point to the proper IP address. Okay, they said the A record has been updated. It should take three to four hours usually, but can take up to 24 to 48 hours. So I'll just thank him and close the call. So I'll come up to the top here, 
click on rate and exit, click on end chat, provide some feedback, click on submit survey, and then I can get out of this. Okay, so I'll come back in a couple hours and see if my forwarding is working. Okay, so if you check your newly purchased domain too early before it's been propagated through the DNS servers, you will get this 404 could not find page error. Usually that means you just have to wait a little bit longer for the propagation to occur, but there could also be a problem with your setup. I would give it a little bit more time and check back later. Well, it's now been a little bit over 12 hours since I set up my A record with HostGator, and I'll check my new domain again. And sure enough, I'm now pointing to my landing page at Ad Kahuna. So this is now working properly, and I'm off to the races. Okay, so I hope you enjoyed this tutorial, and we'll talk to you later. Bye for now.